Today in our handwriting video, we're going to be looking at something called homophones. Now homophones are where you've got the same word, but it's written in different ways. It also will have a different meaning. An example would be the word witch, which can be written W-I-T-C-H, which means an evil hag. Or it could be written W-H-I-C-H, which is a choosing word. I don't know which one to have. Let's have a go at writing some different homophones together. So we'll have a go at writing the word no. No can be written N-O, or it could also be written K-N-O-W. The word groan. Groan can be written G-R-O-N, G-R-O-W-N, or it could be written G-R-O-A-N, groan. The word saw can be written S-A-W, or, or it could be written S-O-R-E, or. And finally, the word weather. Weather can be written w e th -a, or w e th -a. Again, in each pair of these homophones, they will have different meanings. So they won't mean the same, they can be used in different ways. Let's have a go at writing some sentences which contain these homophones and you'll get the idea. So we'll start off with which and which. Now if you've got your witches muddled up, you might ask this question. Which witch is which? This one refers to the lady and these ones refer to the choice. Which which is which? Let's have a go at writing this sentence. No, I don't know. In this sentence, this one refers to the negative no, and this one refers to knowing, having knowledge about something. Let's have a go at the next one with groan and groan. The grown up let out a loud groan. So this one is to do with growing, growing up. Whereas this one is to do with groaning, as in making that noise. Ugh. Let's have a go at the last two. We'll start off with saw and saw. I saw that Sam's arm was sore. This one is to do with seeing, and this one is to do with it being hurt. I saw that Sam's arm was sore. Last one now, weather and weather. Do you know whether the weather will be sunny tomorrow. Now in this sentence, this weather is the choice between one thing and another, and this one is to do with what the weather in the sky will be like.